So during the meeting, I, I presented the patient reported outcome from the luminosity trial. Luminosity, it's a second line trial in metastatic non small cell lung cancer for patients with an overexpression of CMET at immunohistochemistry. So it's a selected subset of, of patients. Luminosity was reported at the last uh, ASCO meeting. It's a two-part phase two uh, trial conducted in uh, non small cell lung cancer patients, squamous, non squamous, EGFR wild type, EGFR mutant. And finally, those expansion was conducted in EGFR wild type, non squamous cell carcinoma patients. This is something like 160 uh, uh, patients. Uh, luminosity met its primary endpoint, pre-specified overall response rate, 29% in this patient population, and up to 35% in CMET I uh, uh, tumors. So, very interesting uh, data. Uh, a phase three trial is, is ongoing, TELIMET, comparing TELIZOVI, this ADC blocking agent that was assessed in luminosity, versus docetaxel. Uh, with regard to the patient reported outcome, it's very interesting to see that uh, patients are reporting uh, uh, symptoms uh, modification based on the safety efficacy profile of Telizovi. We see uh, an improvement in chest pain and cough, which are key cancer related symptoms, uh, and this is related to the response rate. It's even the improvement in those symptoms is even higher in CMET high patients, so it's really correlated with response rate. We also see a deterioration in uh, peripheral neuropathy. Uh, as reported by the patient, and peripheral neuropathy is the most frequent adverse event related to TELIZOV. 40% of patients in, in, in luminosity, 10% with a grade 3 uh, uh, neuropathic uh, event. Uh, all the other parameters were maintained along with uh, the delivery of, of TELIZOV, and uh, we were also uh, uh, interested in looking at the time to deterioration of, of quality of life. And uh, it was interesting to see that uh, time to deterioration of quality of life was actually more prolonged, not only in responders, as, as expected, but also in patients with stable disease, with a de control of the disease. So it means that with this ADC, TELIZOV, it's not only a matter of response, but it's also a matter of disease control, of stable disease, as reported uh, by the patient. So uh, 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 it, it means that uh, uh, for, for, for these patients with aggressive disease, second line metastatic non small cell lung cancer, achieving stable disease means something in terms of quality of life and physical uh, function. So TELIMET uh, is now ongoing, the phase three trial comparing TELIZOVI to uh, docetaxel and uh, with a primary endpoint of PFS and response rate and also quality of life uh, endpoints.